I'm Justin. Oh, I'm sorry. Hey, we're all going to Bob Marshall. We're all fired up. I'm Joas. I'm Justin. I'm Ethan. Who are you? Kendall. I'm Michael. And we're going to go in with these horses, three horses and a mule, and we're going to spend three nights of epic adventure in the Bob Marshall. Woohoo! Well, here we are, hiking back in. Oh, yeah. Boys riding in the back. Having a good time. And Justin and Ethan are side saddling because their legs are getting sore already. Well, we just uh, kind of had a bit of an accident. Look behind me, look at this blowdown and stuff. We just came through here. The trail was closed, but we blazed through, had to go way up over the top of the mountain. No, not over the top totally, but <clears throat> anyways, the mule had a big old wreck, lost all his panniers. And uh, it was pretty epic. The boys found some, something. Let me show you what they got. Yeah, look at what they found. Morale mushrooms. Ain't that a kick in the pants? We're gonna have some mushrooms tonight. It's Kendall and Ethan and Justin. So now we're loading up. We're about a third of the way in and get up, get down there before too late. Look at this. We got in this burn and look at this big old dude right here. I mean, it's like mega. It's seriously big morale right there. Like. Four inch morale, mm -hmm. it's pretty sweet. It's actually really beautiful here. I mean, just look at this. Oh, this fireweed is amazing. We're finding morales up in here. It's uh, all burnt, but it's got a beauty of its own. Look at all the morales we got here in this bag. A complete bag full, gallon bag full of huge fat morales. Gonna have a good dinner, eat them with some trout that we're gonna catch. And uh, maybe some baked potatoes, some huckleberry pancakes or something like that, you know. Not a big deal, just, just good stuff like that. Just awesome, oh man, just look at this. Look how beautiful that is, that's incredible. God's fingerprint, wow. It came from way up over top of that pass. The size of this tree huge trees that are burnt. Wow. Well, here we are. It's probably nine o'clock at night. We had an amazing dinner of fried chicken, a big pan full of morales, and chicken corn chowder and baked potato and dessert and all kinds of good stuff. We got our little tent set up here in the shelter. We're in a beautiful spot by our creek right here. It's just getting dusk. And uh, kind of tied the horses off there. They're getting their fill of this beautiful hay or grass. And Michael's over here glassing, trying to spot some elk like he always is. Boys are rolling a monster rock. Yeah. Nice. We're gonna go into the uh, lake here, this lake that we're here, and we hiked a couple hours in. Our campsite, and here's a trail that we found. Anyways, we're just about there. Yeah, it was a long ways up here. I got my trusty can of bear spray handy. It's pretty. It's a lot of bear poop, grizzly bear poop. And uh, out there's a lake. You can see it through the trees there. Pole. We're way up here in the mountains, and I'm going to show, show you how to catch a big cutthroat trout. It's unreal. It's just so fun. You cast out, then you... Okay. There he is. Look at that big boy. Whoa! Yay! Yeah, yeah. Well, we've been fishing for a couple hours and got a whole mess of these beautiful 
big monstrous cutthroat trout. And now it's time to do something very special. Okay, Justin got a monster. Oh, Justin, get, get him, grab him, just grab him, grab him, grab him. Okay, Ethan's got one. Ethan got the monster. The monster right here, big time. Hey, that's good. That's some meat. Okay, I got him. I got him, boss. Morales. Unreal. Look at that thing. Throw it out of these burns. Big thing. Wow. There we're heading out of the canyon. It's just amazing. Looks like something out of the Lord of the Rings or something. I sure it was fun up here. Pretty steep slope we are going down here. Well, we've been hiking a long time today, and as you can see right here, we came upon some serious specimens. Now this is grizzly bear poop. And what you gotta do, you gotta, there's a few things you gotta know about grizzly bear poop. First of all, the only way you can tell the difference is if it smells like pepper spray and it has bells in it. So what you do is you basically pick it up like that, and you smell it. Like, so, man, I don't smell any pepper spray, so it's probably not, Probably not black uh, grizzly bear, it's probably black bear, and I'm you know, breaking it apart. It's pretty green yet, a little white gooey and stuff, but uh, no bells, so definitely black bear. That's pretty much the only way you can tell. Every time she tightens up the strap, she kind of does a number. <laughs> oh. She's got a little bit of a grumpy attitude when it comes to the cinch around her belly. Cut it out. The boys are out exploring. Huh? You got a sandwich for us? Yeah. Oh my mouse. A mouse? Oh, look at this, what the boys got. They got a good sandwich. No kidding. Oh, fresh. <laughs> Unbelievable. It's a mouse sandwich. <laughs> nice. These guys are doing some creative. Backcountry trail riding. <laughs> well, we're gonna come down here and cross this creek up the other side. There goes Kendall tromping over. Well, we got Ethan cooking morales for dinner. And Justin just got a fish out of the creek here. Let's see how the morales are doing. Oh, Ethan started the fire, got all the food lined out. Looks like the morales are getting there. Looking good, looking real good, Ethan. It's a little cool, but it sure is amazing. All right, heading out of camp. For the last time, there's camp. Adios. Mule's not wanting to go here. Here comes the mule train. We're coming up on an old miner's cabin right here. Or maybe it was a hunter's cabin or something. It's an old hand-hewn corners cabin cross-cut probably. Look at the view they had out here. Not too bad, huh? <laughs> 